Hey everyone, welcome to the monthly balloon showcase series. So basically, at the beginning of every month, I show you guys what my balloon collection looks like. It's July now, so it's time to do that again. But like always, before I show you guys the balloon collection, we are first going to do some calculating to find out how many episodes I have averaged a day since January 1st. So, this is episode 3078. On January 1st, I, I uploaded episode 900. So we've made 2,178 episodes this year so far, and January 1st was 184 days ago. So, 2,178 episodes divided by 184 days will give us our answer. I have made an average of 11.83 episodes a day since January 1st. Not bad. My goal has been to average 10 episodes a day, but it's cool to see that I've been averaging a little bit more than that, so yeah. Alrighty, so now that that's done, I can show you my official July balloon collection. So, in my room, I currently have three boxes. Now you might be wondering, what's with the bags down there? Now, I don't think I'm gonna unpack these balloon bags in this video because this video is just to show you guys what my collection looks like, so I don't think I'm gonna unbox them in this video. Sorry about that. So up here is three assorted balloon packs from Walmart with 72 balloons in each bag. And all right here is a bag of orange balloons I got from Party City and you'll see what I'm gonna do with them in, a, in just a little bit. Hold on, hold on. You don't know what I'm gonna do with this yet? You'll see in just a, probably a day or two. And down here, since I've been running out of black balloons, I got about 75 more black balloons. Now for the boxes. This box right here is the one I store my normal size 12 inch balloons and that's where the assorted balloons in the bags are going to go. They're obviously going to go in this big box. Now right here is my box of 17 inch balloons and um, I have three of them in my room right now. I think you guys can guess what these three balloons are. And next to that is this box, which, which has my 36 inch balloons. These balloons are huge. I have not inflated one of these balloons on the channel yet, but I don't think I'm gonna do that for a while. I'm saving these balloons for like episode 10,000. In fact, if I inflate one of these balloons all the way, it won't even be able to go through my door. That's how big they are. All right, so that's pretty much the entirety of my balloon collection in my bedroom. But wait, I forgot. I forgot to mention these balloons. I inflated all of those balloons before the 1000th episode. They're pretty old. Oh, you might be wondering where the 300th balloon is. The 300th balloon sadly popped. I don't wanna talk about it. But hey, on the bright side, at least the rest of them are still here. Even the 100th balloon. The 100th balloon is like, what, 80 years old in balloon years? So basically in balloon years, one month equals 10 years. So basically a one year old balloon is about three days old. But the thing is, I have two more balloons in my closet. So up here in my closet, I have this yellow balloon and this green balloon. They are using my closet as a sort of nursing home or whatever. This balloon is really old. Uh, how, how many years old would this balloon be? Let me think. Um, this, this balloon is... This balloon is almost 260 years old in, uh, in human years. This balloon is literally 260 years old. This balloon was inflated in, in freaking May of 2018, and it's still alive. I cannot believe that. And the green balloon was inflated in uh, July. So this balloon's almost 240. Okay guys, so we're now done touring the balloons in my bedroom. But this room isn't the only place I store balloons. After I inflate this balloon, I will show you where I store my already inflated balloons. All right, now it's time to go to the other place I store my balloons. As you guys can see, there is no more balloon pit. But since I got rid of the balloon pit, I needed somewhere else to store my balloons. Yes, this is exactly what you think it is. 
This isn't a balloon pit. This is an entire balloon room. Before I turned this room into the balloon room, it was just a crappy storage room, basically. There was a whole bunch of junk in here. We ended up throwing more than half of it away. And yeah, be, yeah, yeah, that, it's, it's a long story and I don't really want to explain it. All that matters is that I still have a place to store my balloons. In many ways, this is actually better than the balloon pit. The balloon pit was just something that you could look at. You can never really interact with it. But with this room, like, you can actually play in this. Like, I would never let anyone play in the balloon pit because it would break really easily. But this, this is meant to be played in, basically. This is meant to be interacted with. Seriously, this is really cool. I'm really happy that I got the opportunity to have this. And I am looking forward to making more inflating of balloon episodes in here in the future. All right, hope you all enjoyed the video. Stay tuned for the next video, which I'm pretty sure is gonna be tomorrow. Anyways, see you later, guys.